A new safety survey on Fort Myers Beach shows the number one issue many of you want to see addressed is pedestrian safety. Fox 4's Jessica Alporn took those concerns straight to the town's mayor. She's live right now on the island to explain the unique challenge he says his town faces. Jessica. Well, you'll notice it's pretty dark behind me here on Estero Boulevard and even along this crosswalk taking you towards Times Square. But while many people want to see more lighting to make it safer, Mayor Ray Murphy says pedestrian safety is a balancing act with protecting wildlife. The difficulty is how close turtle nesting season and tourist season follow each other. We're in turtle season now and lights on Estero Boulevard have to be shaded or have to be a different type of light so it doesn't attract and endanger hatchlings. But nearly 80% of the more than 600 surveyed said they feel flashing lights at crosswalks would make them feel safer. And with tourist season directly following, it brings even more people to the island. So it's the two T's, turtle, tourist. And so we go from uh, protecting the turtles, now we're protecting the tourists. So we have to have sufficient light out there on those poles to protect both groups, uh, the, the people, more light, the turtles less light. So that's the act. More than 40% said crosswalks on the islands have poor visibility. And out here live right in front of Times Square, I spoke with a business owner over there. He tells me this crosswalk in particular, Old San Carlos and Estero Boulevard, is a perfect example. And making changes to it could even improve traffic. If they would have an actual crossing sign that would allow folks to build up and then cross in a big group versus one after another creates that backup that we see across the bridge. The town's public safety committee just conducted this survey. The results are so new they haven't even made it on a town council agenda yet. And as leaders get ready to formally discuss, they've been working with consultants to hear solutions. They also have to work with Lee County since Estero Boulevard is a county road. People also sounded off in this survey about bike lanes and changes that would make it safer for both cyclists and pedestrians. So at seven, I'm going to show you a new test project here on the island that the town is looking at right now to see if it'll help make a difference. Reporting live on Fort Myers Beach, Jessica Alpern, Fox 4. All right, Jessica.